Good morning, just me today. Well, for right now. Still waiting for Alex to show up. He's got some work to do today. Uh, specifically, this roofing to go up there. So that's his, that's his uh, main task for the, for the day, I believe. The catchment is coming along quite nicely. Still got to figure out where to get uh, more of these panels. More of these panels here because we actually want to go two rows of them. These are two feet, two feet uh, tall, so we want four feet tall. And at this diameter, it'll give us around, effectively, like 6,000 gallons of storage, so, which would be awesome. And we also got to go into town and talk to some folks at this one place uh, who seem really knowledgeable um, to get the lowdown on, on how to properly fasten these together. So. I mean, we can buy the hardware that fits, and it'll work, but uh, we just want to make sure that there's, you know, if there's, like, a proper way that we should do this, especially if we're going to stack too high, um, what we should be either getting for it or, or what. So I will be continuing to tackle these blocks. So I have a, I've rethought, rethought my strategy. So I'm going to play around with the blocks. Um, no view of the mountain today, not so far this morning, but it is a beautiful sunny day, so hopefully those clouds move, and we'll get a view of the mountain, and faintly see an outline, but, but yeah, so that's the day today, um, catchment and concrete, once, once we get, uh, these blocks all set, then, uh, then work starts, starts getting faster, because then we can get four joists lumber in here, lay down the floor, and we're going to start working on framing, and then, you know, the exciting stuff starts to happen, so, but, got to lay out all the concrete first, but, uh, pretty soon, pretty soon. This is here now, roofing panels are out there, hope I don't need to go anywhere, put the roofing panels right in the middle of the driveway, but anyway, um, so he's got his stuff, so he can do his stuff, and on to this project, still no view of the mountain. First time the Mercedes has been out here. <laughs> there she goes. And you can see the progress on the roof, on the catchment. So that's coming right along. We're hoping to go five, five wide, three rows, five wide. But uh, but it was really short on the on the right side there. So we're going six wide, six panels wide. I we'll have to buy, I believe, what three more panels? One, two, three. All right, calling it a day for now. Uh, the back row of blocks are in, set level, all lined up. So just need to get. I think you need to get 12 more blocks because they decided to double up on those. You need to get three more roof panels for here. And then he can finish this up. So far it's looking pretty good though. Yeah. The back of the van's a little dirty. So I'm not gonna bother with like an actual car wash, but I figured I'd just rinse it off because that's that looks pretty terrible. So token effort, but we're gonna try this out. The little shower pump thing. Which I actually don't use this in the shower because this tube is too short. It doesn't actually reach the top of the tent thing. So I've been using that other shower head we saw in the other way way back when video. But that's actually been working quite well. And now for a bucket of water. Ducks. Or duck. Hi duck. This guy was doing Tai Chi late, uh, earlier. It's okay. You're on YouTube. What's nice about this one is you don't have to prime this one. You just turn it on, it starts going. The angle of the shower head's really narrow though.
marginally better, but it is better. So I'll go with that.